Dakota took care of them pretty easily due to the fact that they were winning those rotations. Yeah, for sure. It feels like this map is really going to test the mental of NYSL, really to see where they're at, as you said, off of a dominant 3-0 loss versus Optic Texas. One of those losses was here on Hotel, where they got outslayed massively. I think Tug was highlighting it. It was like 30 plus start. They have done pretty well when it comes down to things. 25 uncontested points. Rocker get their first bit of time inside of the HP. Yeah, it was New York who started off on the better side towards the QZ, so they get that in and YSL can begin to focus their attention over toward the bar. Gives me quick work. Nearly finds three. Sets up Hydra there for the fourth. Echo to not give up all this time to the NYSL players. They're trying to do it, but they can't find any of those kills. So now with three being down, New York are already off oh, the rotation. Kisman also has reinforcements. We'll see if Rocker can lock this down or if Priesta can spoil the party. P-Dog running through the kitchen wild. Excellent recovery here from ends at bar. Rocker trying to make it big and dead here early on in these first few team fights. Cammy and Vance. Long time duo, able to put in a decent amount of his team into an early hard point victory. Jay, it feels like so often Rucker go based off of how Bance's play is, and right now, and even you will completely take that. Oh, yeah, you would say trying to attack. Yeah, a huge hard point to close out our first set of rotations. As we said, really, when it comes down to both these teams fighting to Chamber, New York had a lot of success first go around. That's already three dead in the feed. Last player oh. is going to be Bance. He gets cut down by P Dog. Clean four dead. But now with all the spawns on, with a couple players from New York on this side of the map, you're going to get those free spawns over to the Minnesota Rocker, but not for long as they find those final two kills. They flip the spawns right on back. Now they're continuously growing that lead. Yeah, it just feels like this could be an opportunity where New York really start to stretch their legs a bit. They just have and the energy is there for the subliners the biggest thing that i took away though in those comms was hydra telling priesta to hit that flank that is what we'll see how it pans out this is oh, no. right now for rocker but how about the dolphin dive that comes in from fame in ysl instantly have to flee holding down your setups they were great on the p1s but basically flawless on that p2 given some intel that i believe it's hydra in the back that is a lovely two for one that goes that spot over at the desk run caesar run afro no oh! right back through main arch and he's able to find two to now put kismet in a 1v2 everybody throws a shoulder you just want to stay alive waste as much of this clock as possible Wait. but kismet actually hops on it there's no way there so far yeah Big kills about to be inbound. That bomb is rotating over, and New York are ready for it. That's another side. The Hydra, wonderful timing. Give it a catch out. Cami, Afro, now Soul Man alive. On to this. He's actually found up close. He's found up close. Oh my God, it's a team kill, but it is a round. His debut for a rookie in CDL history. Funny enough, the other player was actually part of Minnesota Rocker, Standy, back in Cold War. Afro in a great position to at least spot this player on the cross towards bomb. The trophy system is going to be down, so Kismet can potentially get out with his life, and he does so. But Bance immediately finds a priest there for the trade. 2v3 now. The big dolphin dive from Afro sets things up. Man, yep, another kill. Priest at last man alive. A 1v3 instantly on. The as soon as he gets it down, he finds three kills. Oh, great gun by Big three. They're on to Bane. Does he have a second one? Not gonna happen. As well. All ready to push. Has been shut down. Only 30 seconds left for the subliners to try to get aggressive up Ooh. through the field. Priesta with the snap on to Everybody found the kills that they needed to, and now Skies is left up. To try to get up towards one of these points, but they're able to stop that clock. Don't have any radio tower control as Priest is holding down that power position. They try to get over towards A. They all get cut down. Now they're all back off spawn. And this is just a wonderful reply here from New York as they look to try to put in the choke of round five attack victories. So just in general attacking victories here in El Cielo lately here in Columbus. I don't know what it is about Columbus, but just makes God get a little crazy. Into the B zone we go, just as you called, Jay. Trying to get that one done and dusted. Yeah, Priest are roaming oh. through the back of the spawn as Bans finds a couple kills in a row. They're able to stop that clock for now, but... It's only a matter of time before Priester strikes on the flank. He takes down Cammy, and now his teammates are here to assist. It just feels like if you're New York. Bans, get out of here! You have to make these kills count. If you are New York, just 
play your corners make the kills a lot more difficult as hydra strikes first afro there with the trade they know there's a couple more players up towards the white trucks afro at least finds two but now but everything else was all subliners more specifically priesta we know the head-to-head -head matchup between subliners is not good in this mode a 0.77 in hard point new york have been absolutely dominating him but already into this game the subliner starting off on the better side they get 21 seconds off of that p1 they maintain the spawns over towards p2 but rocker have the he's able to find that remaining junk time and now off the rotation it can start to get a little bit scary kismet finds another two skies already puts himself oh in a position God. towards the back he takes down oh. one kismet is here to strike you find the trade onto fame and that's full rotation going to the subliners York continue to set this hard point in place kismet not able to drop Bance, however, thankfully the teammates are there from the front. Now the push comes. Hydra drops once more. However, it is again the rest of the teammates, the bodies. Cruise missile nearly snaps on the three in a row. Skies finishes his work. New York up by a hundred already. Yeah, this game is getting out of hand. Rocker need to find something. Across the board. Hydra 14 and 8. Skies 15 and 8. Priest to having a great game. Kismet. 14 and 11. That's your objective guy. That's the guy who's trying to get the trades. Or they're trying to set you up for the trades. Impeccable stuff so far from the subliners. But Rocker, they've got to dig deep. They've made crazier comebacks previously. Can they do it again? As we'll step aside and see if the comms are sounding. Down 100. Can they do it? A check. It's going to be a huge battle across the map. Can be the only player here for Rocker. He does get sniffed to play. Some flawless, flawless hard points to try to climb back on him. First line of defense is Bance. Oh. He does get sniffed out. Hydra has a cruise missile. Pretty sure everyone on subliners has a cruise missile to work with. <laughs> but so far, Rocker, 10 seconds in. Not a single player from subliners past that 50 point mark. It's really not a matter of if it'll happen. It's just a matter of when. What will Rocker do to answer? All players from New York making their way in toward the back. All four strong. Is this the final break of the game? It very well could. They absolutely can win it here. Minnesota trying oh. to cause some problems, but Hydra not be the game. All of Rockers spawning all the way across the map. All you have to do is hold down to one more push. Five seconds. Subline is called series. Well, just a few seconds away. Is this the moment for the guy holding down his pre-aims, winning his one-on-ones, making the